Well, this is really a, an important deal for Emirates Team New Zealand. It's the first collaboration deal in the history of the America's Cup that I'm aware of within the, the rules allowed, where ourselves and uh, the Italian syndicate Luna Rossa will share all design information and testing information within the period allowed under the rules. Luna Rossa, their new boat, will be built in New Zealand. It'll be identical to our first boat, and we'll be sailing in New Zealand together in, uh, later next year. I think one of the major advantages is being able to uh, collaborate with such a successful team as Luna Rossa. Uh, and in the end, you know, the, the, the game is to try and win the America's Cup, so we've got to do whatever's possible. But there's a wider benefit as well. We have government money, and here we bring back significant hours into the industry, probably 50 to 70,000 man hours of just boat building alone comes to the industry. Luna Rosa will bring uh, 60 team members later next year. They'll build a base in Auckland and uh, be based here. So there's a wider, not just the marine industry, but there's a wider economic benefit as well. The ultimate goal of any campaign is to try and win the ultimate prize for us, which is the America's Cup. And Oracle conceivably started with an advantage, they've certainly got no money issues. So collaborating with a strong team like Luna Rossa, bringing them to New Zealand, then building their boat, helping the industry, ultimately it helps us, uh, it helps Luna Rossa, and both of us at the end of the day hopefully are quicker. Well, the two teams will collaborate within the what's allowed within the rules, but come America's Cup time, we're enemies.